Happy Monday, Spanish dreamers. I'm just going to show you a little rooftop view from my patio and it's the most beautiful view in Estepona. So what we're looking at is typical of the Spanish Estepona lifestyle. In fact, Spanish lifestyle, everyone loves, just move along a little bit more, everyone loves a bit of the old apartment or edificio style living. It's a beautiful sunny day here in January. We had a lot of rain on Friday. Thanks for all your, your comments, new subscriptions and likes. Really appreciate it. And now this is another sunny day after a beautiful and glorious weekend in Estepona. What we're looking at now is the church, or Iglesia as it's known, in Estepona, just facing the old town. Absolutely gorgeous and they do some fabulous little concerts in there. Catholic Church of course, which is the biggest religion. And they do wonderful things at Easter, midnight masses and things like this. Even if you don't adhere to any Christian spiritual religion, you can appreciate what they do because the Spanish know how to do drama. Whether it is the passion of the Easter story or whether it's the Christmas events, as you saw on my shorts, on my Spanish dreaming playlist, of the Three Kings and Epiphany, which happened earlier in January on the 6th, 5th and 6th of January. This is just showing you a little bit of where I live. This building here, the edificio where you see all the lovely little lights, this is a new build, or it was actually a, a re, uh, refurbed build. There was a fire there about two years ago, two and a half years ago, and they completed it and refurbished it, and that looks absolutely grand. And then we're just going along the top of the Orcadario, which is where I live. And you can see just a little bit more here. As I said, this is my view. This is my roof patio, which I share with the people in my building, my vecinos, my neighbors. Isn't it just stunning? And we're having a lovely 19 degrees today, 19 degrees Celsius, not in the least bit cold. The Orcadario is known for its beautiful trees, flower pots, plants, flowers, flower beds, the whole shebang. It's just gorgeous. And you can see a couple of the beautiful murals that I touched on before in previous vlogs and shorts. And now we're coming around to the Orcadari itself, which was more or less our starting point, right? This amazing building was completed in 2016 and it was opened in the February of 2016, February, March, around Easter. Again, I'll just pan back for you. This mountain here is the Sierra Bermeja and it gives Estepona a microclimate. So when it's like 38, 40, 42 degrees on the rest of the costa, here it can be maximum 36, although we have had 40 degree days and it's swelteringly hot. You do not go out in the sunshine hours. You don't go out till it's dark, really. And just pan a little bit more. So this is the view from here. This is the view of my Estepona, of my part, my barrio as it's known, my, my suburb. Hope you enjoyed it. Happy Monday and have a happy week. Sending you lots of love. Bye. Bye.